We had heard that after the House passed a bill to sanction the International Criminal Court because of its uh, seeking arrest warrants for Netanyahu, that this wouldn't be taken up in the Senate. But now we're learning something different, that because of this senator, James Risch, he is pushing that the Senate take up this bill as well. So we've been going around today trying to get senators to commit to not supporting a bill that would sanction the ICC. And I just want to tell you a couple of the things that Senator Risch has said about the ICC. He called the uh, attempt to seek arrest warrants absurd. The ICC, like the rest of the international community, continues to be obsessed, he said, with targeting Israel during its time in need. There is no cause for why the court should be investigating Israel, as it is not a party to the Rome Statute, and it has a fully functioning judiciary. But of course, Rish supported the ICC when it went after Putin, even though Russia is not a party to the Rome Statute. In addition, he said Israel has responded to the reckless Hamas aggression with extreme caution for civilians. And I also wanted to say that Senator Rich disparages the International Court of Justice as well when it tried to halt Israel's attack on Rafah. He said the UN has chosen to support terrorists who use hostages as weapons rather than support a sovereign nation that seeks to defend its citizens. And he says the ICJ has shown its hate, bias, and predilection for anti-Semitism. I am disgusted to learn that an American judge on this court has voted for the ruling. And he said the ICJ is both morally and structurally bankrupt, and the United States should immediately cut off any ties to this organization.